It's certainly been, been eye-opening. I, I really didn't realize the, the scope of multiple sclerosis when, when I was first involved, um, especially as, as, as a basic science researcher. Sometimes we get caught up in just shaking a few test tubes and, and whatnot, but, but really, really um, with exposure through NMS and, and uh, summer schools like these, you, you really get a better appreciation of, of how far reaching a, a disease like multiple sclerosis is. The current uh state of MS research in Canada, is re it's really a, an exciting climate right now because so much is, uh, so much is going on and pr probably more, more uh, hot leads, so to speak, right now than ever before. And as an MS, a young MS researcher, this is really exciting because um, it's, it's not a stagnant field. It's, it's constantly evolving and we know more about MS now than we, we did even just a couple years ago. Coming to events like these, and this is, this is one of the first for me, I suppose, um, really underscores that there's a vibrant community of researchers working in MS. And, um, and I, I've met people here from across the country and also from the Montreal Neurological Institute right next door. And I, I didn't really know much about what they were doing before this week. And, and you know, now I'm, I feel like I'm much more in tune with the people um, even at my own institution. This kind of a project like and MS Summer School makes sure that people do collaborate. It's tangible, we do it, we're talking to one another, we recognize what, we're, what our abilities are. And the, the, tw the 40 people who are in this school right now, that's, those are the MS researchers that will be in Canada, working in Canada in 10 to 20 years time. There were only a few of us back in the early 70s who were really committed to the work on MS in this country. But as time went on, as developments occurred, as we knew more about the disease, the need for more research in more and more areas demands that we have a generation after generation of new people who are going to explore these areas. The demands are now great because the future looks so positive. I mean, this is a very positive therapeutic era we're in now. So we need those people to bring it forward.